Uh, Shabbat Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, Wakakadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, pushing his word truthfully and sincerely. And Shalom to the Akim, scattered through four corners of the globe, pushing the word truthfully and sincerely. And Shalom to the Akim, that be like unto the speckled bird, pushing the word truthfully and sincerely. And I say Shabbat Shalom. And this is a uh, another sit down lesson for in the news. Uh, December 7th, 2022, at 11.48 p.m. Central Standard Time. Wow. Indonesia got hit with another earthquake. And I just did a uh, previous uh, sit-down lesson. I just got through a few minutes ago. And it was about like three hours ago. It was reported of a 5.8 earthquake. Now, just hours later, you got another earthquake in Indonesia, a, five, a magnitude of a 5.5 earthquake over there in Indonesia. Man, Indonesia been hitting, been getting hit by a lot of earthquakes lately. Wow, this is crazy. But uh, I'm just going ahead with the news article, and this was published by Reuters. I mean, it was by Reuters and published December 8th, 2022. Last updated at December 8th, 2022. From the Jerusalem Post. And the highlight of this news article and it reads for in the news of December 7th slash December 8th. At uh, 1150 p.m. Central Standard Time. And it reads, Magnitude 5.5 earthquake struck. Uh, El, El Pura, uh, Indonesia, the USGS reports, and it says an earthquake of a magnitude 5.5 struck El Pura in Indonesia on t uh, Thursday, meant to say Slovakia. The United States Geological Survey says the quake was a 37.4 kilometers which is 23.24 uh, miles below the Earth's so uh, surface, the USGS says. Bring out that loop 2111 again, like I did in the previous video, in regards to the uh, earthquakes in diverse places increasingly. This is the book of uh, Luke, chapter 21, verse 11, and it reads, And great earthquakes shall be in diverse places, and famines and pestilence and fearful sights, and great signs shall that be from heaven, right? Because we see in the, uh, we see in the, uh, the famines, the pestilence, you know, the pestilence, pestilence and the, uh, you know, the pestilence of people when they get sick and stuff like that. And diseases causes around the world that as well, too. And then you have a pestilence of a, a, of a weather, weather conditions as well, too. So it can be in two different categories as far as that concern. But the famines that's increasing, the pestilence, fearful sights, we're seeing that. And we're seeing great signs from heaven. You know, with the blood wound recently in uh, November the 8th, last month. So we, we're seeing those signs, you know. And then we're seeing the increases of uh, earthquakes in diverse places. Just like with this upcoming, this new uh, new one just took in place over in Indonesia. So I say for the past month and a half, Indonesia been, hit, been getting hit by a lot of earthquakes on a non-stop consistent basis because I recently like I mentioned before uh, just got through doing a video not too long ago on Indonesia again you know uh, I believe it was the what it was the Java uh, part of Indonesia the west part of uh, Indonesia it was like in the islands I believe over there in Indonesia it was a uh, 
5.8 of a magnitude of an earthquake. And now, a few hours later, you got another earthquake, but it's in a different part of Indonesia. This was a magnitude of a 5.5 earthquake. So, you know, we've been seeing, I say for the past two months, from November and entering December, and I, I will say October all the way into December, you know, this past whole four months, you've been seeing a large amount of increasing of uh, earthquakes in diverse places around the world, you know. Just like the scripture says, uh, I brought out in the last video, you know, with that second Ezra's nine and two, uh, when the highest began to visit the world, what he made, and that's what he doing, you know. So, you know, like I mentioned before, you know, you're gonna see uh, uh, consistently increasing of uh, earthquakes in diverse places in all different parts around the world, you know. And I believe it was a uh, 2.5 earthquake. I forget what a uh, city it was. It was here in the United States. So I wouldn't be surprised you see more earthquakes uh, in the United States, like uh, California, like the upper north, the upper north region of uh, California in the west coast of the United States, right along the upper northwest over there in uh, Seattle and Portland. Wouldn't be surprised if you see earthquakes touch down over there as well, too. And more uh, earthquakes, especially like down south, places like Texas, Alabama, Mississippi, and all those regions as well, too. And uh, earthquakes uh, in diverse places around the world as well, too. You're going to see these things, you know, increase with the weather conditions. And, you know, it's... The Heavenly Father that's doing these things on the planet Earth in regards to the weather conditions that's, you know, on the, on the planet Earth, you know, you know, because it's not, it's not a uh, climate change, it's, the, it's not Mother Nature or climate change, it's the Heavenly Father that's doing these things, you know, he's the creator, he's the creator of everything, you know, you know, he, he uh, gave the whole and he passed it down on to his son, you know. Like the scripture says, the earth is his footstool, you know. So the Heavenly Father, uh, he's the one that's doing these weather events on the planet Earth, you know. Because you're going to see a uh, consistent basis of increase of these numbers of uh, magnitudes of earthquakes in diverse places. You know, you're going to have a... Uh, the number range from the uh, earthquakes around the world. The numbers is going to go up and down from to like a 5.1 all the way into like a uh, 5.9 or 6.3 to that range. But, you know, it's going to expect to see it increase with the numbers as well, too, because the numbers been up and down. I say for the 4.6 range to the 5.2 or 4.3 or 5.6 or 5.7 or 5.8 or even sometimes a 5.6 to 5.9 and sometimes 5.8 as well too. That's what we've been seeing in, in the to the mid 5.4 or 5.5 range I would say. In the last two or three weeks, we've been seeing that, you know, along with the 6.1 and 6.2 of the uh, earthquakes in diverse places. So you're going to see these uh, continuing events occur on the planet Earth. You know, like I mentioned before, the second Ezra 9 and 2, you know, is, is the time when the highest will begin to visit the world, which you made, you know. So, yeah, that's, a, that's an increasing sign that the Heavenly Father is definitely visiting this place, uh, which he made, you know. So, with that, uh, this is just another uh, news article that I just wanted to bring out of the latest earthquake hit Indonesia once again. And this was a 5.5 uh, magnitude in an earthquake struck the uh, part of uh, El Pura of Indonesia, you know. So
So with that, uh, Shabbat Shalom, and I uh, hope this lesson was edifying for in the news of December the 7th slash December 8th, 2022, on this uh, Thursday, December 8th, 2022, and I would like to give all praises and glory and honor to, to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, Dash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Red Millstone, pushing his word truthfully and sincerely. And shalom on to the Akim, scattered through the four corners of the globe, pushing word truthfully and sincerely. And shalom on to the Akim, that be like unto the speckled bird, pushing the word truthfully and sincerely. And until next time, I will say, uh, Shabbat Shalom and the ball. ball.